Welcome to ITU Telecom World 2019 here in Budapest, Hungary, where I'm very pleased to be joined in the studio today by Luis Neves, who is uh, from the Global Enabling Sustainability Initiative, also known as GESI. Welcome to the studio. Thank you so much for the invitation. Now, I'd like to start off by talking a little bit about uh, policy, strategy, technology. What single factor do you think has got the greatest potential to drive uh, digital transformation? Well, I think all of them, you know, it has to be a combination of uh, all the three dimensions. Um, I, I don't think that you can take one out uh, because otherwise we will not achieve the transformation needed. So you, you need, of course, uh, policy uh, to drive uh, the overall transformation process. You need the technology, which is fundamental. Um, so I think the three of them, they have to be combined. How, how important is trust in the digital economy and what are the roles of government and the private sector in ensuring trust and security? Well, you know one thing, uh, I was today on a debate around the trust, uh, moderated by the ITU Deputy General Secretary Malcolm Johnson that is sitting on uh, the JESSE board, he's a board member of JESSE, and uh, the debate was about trust. And uh, I realized that we are missing a very important word in this debate, which is responsibility. We, governments and people, they talk a lot about of trust. But for you to get the trust, you need to be responsible. So business and the, that is driving this transformation and that is putting in place all these innovative technologies, artificial intelligence, IoT, and so on, they have to do business in a responsible manner, manner. If they do that, the trust comes automatically with it. The point now is that we are not addressing the responsibility dimension of business. I'm not saying that business is not responsible. Of course, business is responsible, but there, there is in this new environment um, a challenge for business that we have not yet been able to address. So therefore, what we're doing in Jesse, uh, Taking into account this problematic, uh, we are beginning a process uh, whereby we want to bring to the table business, different stakeholders, the civil society, governments, to develop what we call the Charter of Digital Trust and Responsibility. So we need to define global principles that apply to every single stakeholder because the issue of trust and responsibility is not only for the telecommunications industry, it's cutting across every single industry as well. So we need those principles, we need that in place, and then we need a way to, let's say, it's a kind of certification scheme uh, whereby uh, through a due diligence process, you say, well, these companies are really addressing the issue of ensuring the privacy of the information in relation to its customers. So it's, it's a very difficult process. It's, it's a process that needs to be developed in partnership, but that's a challenge that we are taking in Jesse right now. Now, the theme for this year's conference is uh, innovating together, connectivity that matters. What does that mean to you? Well, connectivity is the underlying technology, and it will be fundamental to create a sustainable environment. So we have done in Jesse uh, different reports. The, the most, uh, let's say, recent one uh, is called Smart 2030. Um, and we analyzed the, the, the impact of technology in relation to sustainable development. And we analyzed different technologies. But the basic te te technology to ensure sustainable development is connectivity. So that's the most fundamental thing that we need to ensure. That requires a lot of investment. That requires the right policy framework. But that's the way that it should go. And finally, what does uh, an event such as ITU Telecom World mean to you? Well, I love these events because the, uh, the ITU has been uh, driving an agenda uh, that is very familiar to Jesse, is, 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 a, is a kind of complementary agenda. Uh, and the ITU, unlikely in the past, we, which was very much in, in this traditional regulatory framework, is now addressing more and more the societal dimension of technology. And uh, I've been seeing that from conference to conference, and I think that's something that will increase the relevance of the ITU, and I think is the right way to go. Well, Lewis Nevis, thank you for joining us in the studio, and hopefully we'll catch up with you again in the very near future. Thank you so much. Thank you.